Love you guys so much. What's up? It's me, Vic. Welcome back to my channel. Hope you're having a wonderful and fantastic week. It's super hot. I am starting to wear my hat because it's hot, and you know. But in today's exciting video, as always, I'm doing another belt bone piercing update. I've done one a couple of weeks ago, but then I had to change the ring and actually kids. And then I had to um, get it repaired in a different spot to have enough skin to hold the ring, actually. So it's doing pretty well. It's still really, really, really sore. It doesn't hurt. It moves a little bit. And it's really, really, really um, red and pinkish around the top barbell as well because I just got it pierced in a new area so it's gonna be super sore and red for a long time but I clean it twice a day with sea salt just for a few weeks and then I'll start cleaning just once a day you do have to clean it once or twice a day you can do twice a day if you want but for now I'm doing twice a day to be on the safe side and then as the piercing progresses um, start stops being sore red and all that I'm gonna just switch to one time a day to keep the piercing clean and for it to heal with my natural body fluids so let me just show you guys the ring real quickly before I go because I do have to go down to Seattle and just things like that so here is my ring you guys as you guys can see that it's super swollen sore and red just around the top area not the bottom and it doesn't hurt like I said it's just super sore has some bumpy skin and everything and as you guys see that um, dark spot right there, that was my previous opening hole where the piercing will go in. I explained this in my last um, video where I got my belly button repaired, but yeah. 